Oh my god, hit it directly into the Bruins player's stick almost. He just gave it to him. He's like, here, you want this? Here you go. Oh, and he scores! And it's Hall. Taylor Hall getting the game's first goal. And it was a beautiful, I believe that's a one-timer. Could you, if you were a Boston Bruins fan, could you ask for anything else than this absolute beauty of a one-timer shot directly into the goal one nothing boston we'll be back here in about uh, five seconds oh he nearly scored now in the final two minutes of the second period byram gonna need it and he got it he's gonna get it tying it look at that gnarly mohawk right there oh and byram the beauty of a shot. Look at this. Six, five, four. Oh, and he gets tripped. No penalty. And the second period comes to an end. Man, who doesn't like a little bit of drama to end off a period? They had a chance, but he got swept off his feet. I mean, the fact that that was not a penalty surprises me in multiple different facets. Of course, he had this beautiful switch-handed goal. Pasternak moving up. Oh, and it bounces back. It kind of reverberated. And oh my goodness! What a rebound! Patrice Bergeron. You strike me, I strike you. Tossing it up to Pasternak. There's a bit of a one-on-one -on -one situation here that was going for a moment, but not anymore. Passing it up, Bergeron! Oh my goodness! There it is again! David Pasternak! Beautiful. Who doesn't like a little rebound score? There he is. Uh, and no, yes, they actually are going to pull the goalie. It's taken away by Riley. They have a chance here. Brad Marchand moving up. He has an opportunity to score a goal here, and he will. You seize every opportunity you're given, and I can absolutely see why he did it there. He got a goal. It seems like they were passing around. I mean, goals like they were nobody's business. Oh! Did he score? Yes, he did! I'm trying to keep that two-goal difference streak alive, I see Miko Rantanen. I was not expecting that. I didn't even notice that it went in at first. It's a play. They're fighting for the puck. It's taken away by Carlo, who moves it up into... And he will get it! Making that goal look useless. In the grand scheme of things, five to two now in favor of the Boston Bruins. Brandon Carlo. I believe now every goal has been scored by a different player. I believe now there's, I mean, seven different players, each with one goal. And you know, it's all about being diverse here with your goal scorers. I mean, having five different players score a goal in this game. That's certainly a way to prove that your team can have multiple players be efficient at scoring goals, and this Festival. game is obviously over. I'll tell you what, they put up a fight, and, you know, I guess, you know, valiant efforts are the ones that usually show the most. Here comes the Boston Bear. I, I still don't understand how those guys were able to walk on the ice. I mean, I, I think there's some special padding that they put on that they put on those gigantic mascot shoes that just like allows them to walk on the ice. Because I mean, you gotta you gotta imagine that ice is probably super slippery. It looks watery. It looks like some of the ice is melted. It looks slightly wa I don't know what period this was. I believe this was the. F yeah, this definitely was the the third period. I